Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video over on Ark Survival Ascended. And I have turned all of my graphic settings down to a ridiculous level because I'm about to spawn in 100, yes, 100 of those, the Christmas presents. They're gonna slowly come down to the ground. And I'm gonna show you what it looks like when you open 100 of them. So hopefully this is something that'll show you kind of what's inside of them, what you can get and all that stuff. And this is technically set to official difficulty. So you should be able to get a good ballpark number of what's going on. So if you don't mind, smash that like button, leave a comment below for the algorithm, and then consider subbing to the channel. All right, let's get started. All right, now here they come in a ridiculous number just so you can actually see what's going on. I'm going to go ahead and look into this one to show you what you generically get, and I'll talk about what you typically get. But I'm going to go ahead and show you that there's a hilarious number. Look at that. That's that's a stack, a absolute stack. Look at that thing. I should, you know, I should go into photo mode just so you guys can see the true craziness of this. Uh, yeah, but there is an insane number of these. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. All right, so anyways, yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and open up all of these packages and uh, just to show you generically what you get. Now, pretty much every single one's going to give you a chibi. They all technically don't. You're usually gonna get coal and mistletoe inside of each one. And then you're also gonna get a significant portion of loot on the back end of it. It could be anything from blueprints to actual weaponry. And uh, sometimes you can get saddles and stuff like that too. I think it's an entire, the entire arc loot table is opened up for the supply crates. So you can get literally just about anything. But the big thing you're looking for probably from these is the chibis because those things are what really, really people want, right? Um, and that's just due to the fact that chibis can be super powerful because you can hide them in your cosmetics bar. But uh, once you use them, they give you the additional five bonus levels. If you didn't know that already, that's how you gain five levels. By killing alphas with these guys, you can get an additional five that stay with you permanently. So definitely start working on chibis and killing alphas. Now, the rest of it, all and mistletoe can be used in order to get generic stuff um, using the uh, smithy this update and uh, kind of go about it that way. And then you can also use the fireplace. If you haven't seen my video about that, you can get some crazy loot, especially because they just fixed it um, to make it so you get some some really, really nice loot out of that, especially if you uh, kill some of the dinos. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Now here comes all of the never ending supply. Oh my goodness, there are gonna be so many of them. I'm just gonna sit here and mash open. Oh my goodness, look at that. Right off the bat, we've got some Ascendant Swords. Chibi dodos. I wish I could just, you know, keep my mouse up there. I don't know of a way to do that though, but you can see how much stuff you're actually getting out of that. I got a raptor claws out of that one. Ooh, there's a blueprint for a bow, sword. I'm kind of just like looking through these barely as I'm going, right? Um, but the amount of loot that you're gonna get, I might actually have it too much loot at the end of this, but we'll see. You can see that sometimes you're gonna get consumables as well from chilies, um, all kinds of stuff. Ooh, that was a double chibi. Ooh, that one's got a good blueprint in there. Wow, it's a lot of stuff right there, right? Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, there's a lot of stuff here and I'm going as quick as I can and it still feels like there's a ridiculous number of stuff here. Um, I do like that there are like certain rarities to the chibis though, I will admit that. I think that's kind of cool that some chib chibis are considered rarer than others. Oh wow, I'm getting a lot of, a lot of structures actually. So I would definitely grind those structures pretty much immediately. Um, and by the way, just so you guys know, there's not necessarily a benefit to having the actual chibis be different or the same. They are, whether they are rare or not rare, they are all still super valuable. And uh, yeah, pretty pretty nice to just have access to, right? Um, man, there's some decent loot in this actually. There's a stego saddle on that one. You can see already how much uh, blueprints I've gotten out of this. So this is definitely a, ooh, that was a really good black piece. Um, this is definitely a great way to farm blueprints. Arguably, it's one of the best uh, blueprint farms in the entire game, just because you can get these every single night. There's going to be a Santa Claus. Now, you might have to fight some other people off of it, but uh, if you're playing on an unofficial server or solo play, definitely use Santa Claus as much as you can, because you can get some bonkers loot. Um, I just saw a different chibi that I haven't seen before there, I feel like. Is that an Ammonite chibi? I think it was. That was kind of cool. Um, there's a good saddle 90 armor saddle that's not very common by the way that seems kind of broken but you know it is what it is there's another saddle there micro raptor um wow lances 
Dodos, Raptor Claws. It seems like Raptor Claws is actually pretty common. I thought it was going to be a little bit more rare, but it seems to be pretty common inside of this at least. And uh, I've gotten actually a couple of those Ammonite Chibis now, which is kind of cool. Another Raptor Claws. Oh my goodness, game. Another Stego Saddle, Apprentice Pistol, which seemed to be incredibly common in there. All right, so let's look at all of the loot that we just got, right? So it is organized. So we've got bow blueprints, crossbow. That's a really good crossbow blueprint. Okay, I will take that all day. Um, so you can get some good crossbow, blue, crossbow blueprints. Uh, looks like I got a ton of pike BPs. That's a crazy pike. These two are nice. 245 243% without a boost. Uh, sword, I've almost got 200% on a couple of those. That's pretty awesome. And then a really, really nice bow right there. But uh, you can see that there's some good overall. I mean, that's a really nasty blueprint. 90 armor. That's crazy. Terror bird saddle. But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, you can see I got a ridiculous amount of coal. Um, some cooked jerky, crossbows, chitin, some basic stews and consumables. Um, gilly, mistletoe, mastercraft sickles. Um, pikes, packy rhino saddles. I got a bunch of those for some reason. A very large number of hard polymer. There's what? One, two, three, four, five, almost 600 large or hard polymer. That's not too shabby. Uh, spark powder. And there's some good loot in there. Uh, that's even a decent stego saddle at 45 armor. Not amazing, but still pretty good. Um, and then this I like that 230% sword for free. Yes, please. A ton of wood spiked walls. But yeah, you can see that this is really worth it. And I've seen a ton of flak BPs, by the way. I don't know if I got any in this one. I feel like I didn't. Um, but when I've opened these, I've gotten a bunch of flak BPs. So it's a great way to farm flak BPs and just in general, just running these for BPs. So definitely really strong. But that's what happens when you open 100 of those things. Um, not too bad. I mean, it could have been a lot better. But really what I enjoy is these uh, cosmetics, the chibis, right? The Raptor Claws chibi is really what I want. Um, hello, I'm going to name him Hello. And uh, pretty cool when you get the Raptor Claws chibi because it's a special chibi with the, yeah, the super cool hat on him. Hey, buddy. Um, but you can also get some of the rare chibis too, which is kind of nice. There's the Megalodon, Manta, the Island, Hylana deer. Oh, wow, I haven't seen that yet, I don't think. Hyena deer. That creepy oh yeah actually that's really creepy it's really quite terrifying it's the first time i've seen that one it's absolutely terrifying all right so it looks like yeah that's that's pretty cool my dairy is kind of fun too i don't know if you've seen the water ones but they kind of just like hover like this in their little ball of water kind of cool yeah, so that's what happens when you get that much loot. So hopefully this video is something you enjoyed. But other than that, if you don't mind, smash that like button, leave a comment below for that algorithm, and then consider subbing the channel. All right, teach. Oh.